distant sticks. Pretty much every fishing company out there now do their own version of them. And for the most part, they're glorified bank sticks with a high vis topper on them, do the same job of wrapping out your line so you hit the same distances each and every time. But some of them can cost in excess of £100, which is a hell of a lot of money. So Gardner have actually gone down the other end of the spectrum and brought in their rangefinder distance sticks for just £29.99, which I think is an absolute steal. I'm sure by the end of this video, you will agree with just how much value for money is in these distance sticks. So to start with, they come in their own dedicated bag with a couple of different pockets. On the front, we have a strap in there, which can put your distance sticks at different intervals. So 12 foot, 30 foot, six foot, and 10 foot, I believe it is. That's a really random way of going through that uh, range of distances. And then the top pocket, you have your two distance sticks. So if you pull them out, they actually each go into their own dedicated pocket on the inside of this, which keeps them nice and separate. So in transit, they're not clunking around onto each other. And the sticks themselves are actually pretty tall. They are 24 inches in length, and all the way up them, you've got four different hardened rubber grips. Now this is to stop your line from sliding up or down on the sticks when you're wrapping out your line. There's nothing worse if you've ever experienced it when you're wrapping out and one of the loops at some point in wrapping out comes up off the top. You know that you're in for a good 10, 15 minutes of trying to untangle and get rid of all those knots that has un uh, unraveled from that happening. So having these on there should prevent your line from slipping up. There's little grooves in each of them which lets them bed in slightly more, but just the rubber alone gives a nice gripped texture to stop that line or at least drastically reduce the risk of your line sliding up and down on them. You've got a lovely matte black finish on the rest of them down at the very bottom. As you'd expect, we've got points, but they're not stupidly pointy so that they'll sort of degrade very quickly when you hit rough ground. They're slightly snubbed on the very end, but it means they're really hard wearing. And we'll get on to how you actually put these into the ground. Pretty obviously, on ground like this, I can just push down and they'll go in. But if you're on really rocky ground, they have brought out some different caps to help you do that. So moving all the way up to the caps, we've got these two luminous yellow caps. Now these actually unscrew. And if you have a look on the inside of them, once it gets to the end of the thread, there's a little rubber plug which you can pull out and that fits in an isotope so if you want to use these at night obviously you can use a head torch but when you've got those and then you'll see where your, your distance sticks are at night and they fit a dis isotope in really nice and easily now whilst on the topic of these top end caps of course these are extremely visible easy to see in the day help you see them at night as well you can put an isotope in but they are made of plastic so if you're trying to get these distance sticks into a hard ground like i said today it's not a problem it's pretty muddy you don't really want to be whacking the top of that with a mallet. If you are someone that likes to take a mallet with you, think about your life choices. But there is some instances where you do need to get your sticks into a really tough ground. So these aren't really going to be up to the job of being smacked by a mallet. So in this pocket, if I take this strap out first, there's a little pack packet which has two metal caps. Now these just replace the luminous ones. You unscrew them put these ones on and these are up to the task of being smacked repeatedly with a mallet so you can get that into harder ground. You can leave the black ones on if you like, if you prefer the completely black look, but once you've got them in, you can uns unscrew these and put the high-vis ones back on. I prefer the high-vis ones, just lets it, well, it's a lot easier to see them both day and night. And when you're wrapping out, it's just a lot easier again to see where the very tops of the sticks are. So it's nice and easy to get your line around them without getting it all tangled up. So that's the two different caps that are available in the range, well, in the kit, sorry. If I put this bag down, which is a very nice heavy duty bag, may I add, which is nice to keep it all in transit. It then comes with a really heavy duty strap. Now this has metal loops or ringlets at the very end of this one. So obviously this is where you put your bank stick through, stab that into the ground, and it keeps it in situ. Now this has different markers all the way along. So if I unravel it really quickly, you've got markers at six foot. So this is ideal for if you've not got much space to use a distant sticks, but you want to use, still use them, you can wrap them at six foot, or if you're using smaller rods as well. So you've got six, and then you go all the way up to the next ringlet, which if you peg out from this one to the first end one is 10 foot, then go up a bit more, you've got your 12 foot, and lastly, 13 foot and these are fixed so no longer which is what i often do if i don't have a kit that has this with them i line my rod down put one at the tip end and the bottom end which yes it works but you do run the risk of damaging your eyes and your rods if you're putting them down on the floor like that and this just means every single time you use them as long as you're using these ringlets you're getting exactly the same distance between sessions and it's there's no stretch in that it's a solid straps so it's not like when you pull it tight you might be gaining a few inches or losing a few 
It's absolutely solid and really hard wearing. And the fact that it's got those ringlets in there all the way along just makes it really easy to whether you're using your 12 foot rods, 13 foot, 10 foot, or even six foot, or just need to use the six foot setting on a much smaller swim where you haven't got the space to spread them out as far, then that's where this comes in really handy. Of course, you don't have to use them, but it's nice to know that it's in there. So that is the complete rangefinder distance sticks from Garden. And as I've already mentioned, I said the price at the very start, all of that comes in at just $29.99. So in a world where a lot of companies can pretty much have your pants down and charge you an arm and a leg for a glorified bank stick, as I said at the start, it's nice that Garden have come out with something as high end as this, and it feels really robust and good quality, does everything you need a distance stick to do, but it's not just the sticks. It's really nice that it comes in at such a budget-friendly price. So for more information, do Google them, have a look on the Gardener website of these and many other items, and also make sure you subscribe to us and hit the bell icon so you don't miss any future uploads and check out previous videos on Gardener Kit, and also there'll be more coming from the future. So that's it from me for now. Cheers for watching, and I'll see you again soon.